Welcome to the season finale of the 1994 Grand Prix 2 season. Welcome. Welcome chat. Welcome boys. Welcome girls. Uh, welcome everybody. Excellent. We're, we're, we're back. Hopefully everything is working as it should. It usually does. But anything can happen in Formula 1. Uh, anyway. We're, we're back, and I know that 800 subscribers special. Indeed, we just hit 800 subscribers, which is very cool. Uh, yeah, that's, that's a lot of people. Uh, yeah, but didn't really plan it that way. Uh, the reason we're doing GP2 now instead of IndyCar racing is that uh, I'm just very anxious to get GP2 out of the way and get to GP3. I, I managed to find a way to make the game run and uh, and also to stream it live so so that should be very very interesting I, I did some testing here about an hour ago and everything seemed to be working all right except that the capture software that I use messed up all my uh, audio settings so I had to reset them all just before I started to stream, which sucked. Uh, let's check out the uh, championship table here. Hello, hello buddies, hello. Uh, yeah, championship table. Schumacher has secured his championship. Damon Hill and Coulthard are battling for uh, the second place. And Alessi Berger and Friedrich Bang are battling for the fourth place in the championship. And uh, for me, like, the fourth place would be my tiny little personal world championship victory. Because, uh, can you do a video tutorial on how to get GP3 working with Windows 10? Uh, no, I cannot, because it doesn't work with Windows 10. Uh, there's just absolutely no way. Uh, I'm running the game with Windows 7, and then I went on and I bought a capture card in order to capture it, because the, the capture software didn't work well with the game, so... Uh, that, that, that really, really is, has been a pain in the ass, but I think I got it, got it figured out now. I mean, you can't get the game running on Windows 10, it just crashes to the des desktop randomly, and... When you're doing full races, that is unacceptable. But yeah, back to the business, where... Fighting against the Ferraris for P2, uh, P3 here in the championship. That would be cool. Here you will see no changes, at least at the top, of course. If some surpriser gets some points, then these guys might change positions. Are you running GP3 with GPX patch? Yes, I am. Yes, I am indeed. With Windows 7, that is. Uh, didn't help with Windows 10. Nothing helped. I tried everything, so don't say that try this or try that. I've already tried it. Yeah. Alright. Um, here we go. Next up, it's... Let me pronounce this correctly. Adelaide. Australia. A magnificent street circuit. One of my favorites. Definitely. Uh, I, I, I like this track a lot, and what I like even more is that, uh, according to my practice races, the AI sucks here. They suck really bad. They're worse than in any other circuit, and the pace should be pretty damn good. Let's accelerate the time here a little bit so we get some times on the table. That's good enough. We're at the halfway point here. Yeah, shame they changed it. Indeed, I'm not a big fan of of uh, Melbourne myself. Always suck at Melbourne, and yeah, fourth place in the championship for Bang. If everything goes perfectly to today, it might be, but we we still have to worry about technical issues and and all that. So yeah. Uh, speaking of the practice races, I also have a Twitch channel. 
Now, uh, if you're into that, go check it out. Uh, you, uh, the link is in the video description and it's in the channel page and it's on my web page and it's everywhere. But it's twitch.tv slash tet underline meet. Uh, so that is that is the, the, the channel uh, I already streamed there today when I did my practice race for this race. And you can find the practice race there. It was pretty interesting. Uh, but the idea is that uh, on Twitch I will do some practice stuff and uh, and uh, what else? Yeah, some more relaxed stuff. And I will keep the real races on YouTube because, like, I don't want to mess up the concept with YouTube because it seems to be working pretty nicely and people enjoy it. But yeah, that's the Twitch thing then. Oh, Taka Harvey has watched you on Twitch. Oh, that's nice. Uh, me, not you. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty tired. Sorry. Yeah, not not a lot of viewers there, but that's totally to be expected, and I didn't expect a lot of me. Repeat this season with another car. Uh, I'm not going to repeat this season with another car, but I'm going to do like some other season of the 90s with well I'm going to do multiple seasons of the 90s in 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 GP2 with mods and uh, yeah so yeah uh let's let's qualify shall we Sorry, I can't read the chat at the moment because I'm obviously concentrating once again. As you can see. And now I'm ruining qualifying laps for these guys. Yeah, I pretty much have to relearn how to drive now because I was trying GP3 just a minute ago and uh, it's it's very different. I mean, in GP3 the thing is you don't have any grip because of the darn groove tires. You have just about the same amount of power but not, no grip. I'll just let these guys go so we can hopefully get a clean lap here. Yeah, this is the last race in GP2 in this season, but we're going to do other seasons. Okay, let's concentrate for the qualifying lap now. Pretty good, a couple of little mistakes there, but quite alright. And that's a pole position lap, everybody. That's going to be a healthy pole position. As I said, the AI really sucks here. I don't know what's their problem. At least in qualifying. In race pace they are a lot quicker. But in, in race they have a lot of problems with the back markers. So hopefully we can use that into a, 
our advantage. I simply love this track and, and the car behaves beautifully. I, I think I have a pretty damn good setup here. I mean, it feels like it's it's on the edge, but it's it's uh, very predictable. Uh, the job is done, back up, and let's go grab some beer. So there we go, one second faster than Schumacher. So suck it, everybody. <laughs> yeah, this race is completely mine to screw up. Let's, I, I think we're done with the qualifying, so let's... Let's hello Michael, hello Elaine. I uh, Elaine, I'm I'm sorry I probably butchered your name. I don't know how to pronounce it. So yeah, here are the session standings. Coulthard, Juma, her Coulthard seems to be very fast here. Hill, Alessi Berger, Ferrari is not doing too great, which is good news for us, since they are our main rivals. Verstappen, Katayama, friends, and Morbidelli, Barrichello, 11 to 2.3 seconds behind his teammate. Hakkinen doing terribly, once again. And Casho and Belmondo not making the cut based on the first qualifying. Friedrich Bang screw up the race. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. I mean, when, the, when has that ever happened? Maybe DC will hit the pit wall, or it might be that DC will hit Friedrich Bang. Okay, here are the final results. DC behind us, Schumacher, Hill, Alessiberger. Nothing much has changed here. Not a lot of improvements in, in the second qualifying, as you can see. Only the white ones have improved, and it's kind of weird, but usually the AI doesn't improve a whole lot during the second qualifying. Casho and Belmondo out. Belmondo, 8 seconds off the pace. Fantastic job. It's a good thing he's not racing. Yeah, so uh, let's go to the race and it's going to be a three stop strategy. Uh, that's definitely, definitely the way to go. Hi to you, John, as well. Uh, Definitely the way to go. Sometimes the AI seems to take a one-stop strategy here, which is a horrible, horrible mistake. It doesn't work. Uh, and yeah, the start is... I think it, the overtaking is, is act, actually pretty easy in GP2 here. The AI breaks very early into the hairpin and into the... I think it's turn 4? No, it's 5. So yeah. And the good thing is that the front straightaway is not very long. So if we get a good start, I think we can get to the first corner, uh, into the first corner first. But we'll see how this goes. And now I'm starting to feel nervous. Great. So there's the grid. Okay. Wish me luck, boys. We are ready to go, and once again, actually, let's just in case save the game instead, in case there are some technical difficulties with with DOSBox. And let's go. Now I will shut up for a minute and try to concentrate on the race. Here we go.
got it. A little bit of wheel spin at the start, but we got it. I had to give him the space, but he didn't go for it. No, this is not a good place to overtake, dude. up my driving Okay, DC is very fast. I wonder if Christian Fittipaldi, the fastest lap. How often do you see that? No, DC, no. Not here, man. Might be that our race pace isn't that great. But we'll see once once I'll get into a rhythm. That was better. Zanardi out. This has been a lot better lap. Yeah, Dominic, this setup is not for qualifying. I always use the same setup for race and qualifying. I don't bother to change it. All right. Now that's a lap time.
Schumacher seems to be all over DC, so hopefully they'll slow each other down. Good lap. Okay, so far so good. We're not dead yet. Such a great lap. This is seems to be very fast. Also, Schumacher is fast, so I'm I'm guessing they're both on a two-stop strategy. A uh, three-stop, I mean. But we can never be too sure. My lap times have, have been alright and they're still kind of keeping up, so... I'm suspecting light cars. And it's Schumacher. Second now. So we'll see if he's faster than, than DC. The first sector is so busy. You have to concentrate real hard.
Lap times are good. But Schumacher is pretty much matching our pace, which is kind of has me a bit worried. Because I hate to brag, but I'm driving very well at the moment, and I don't like the fact that I'm not really pulling a gap to Schumacher. Absolute fastest I dare to drive. Okay, Alesi having problems is pitting already. And already see the first lapped car. One of the dozens of Simtex we're going to see today. It might work in our advantage because, as I said, the AI doesn't really deal very well with the lap, lap traffic on this track. It also depends a lot on where you catch them. might be burger okay uh, apparently I have missed something no that's the same deck Come on, please just let me go. Ah, oh, that was very awkward. Burger pitted after first lap. Okay, this is a nice trade away. It gives me a chance to glance at the chat. So apparently our battle against the Ferraris is going very well at the moment.
Oh man, a lot of lap traffic in front. exit there. Would have been nice to catch even one of these cars at this straightaway. This might cost us, cost us a lot of time. <laughs> Okay, great job guys, great job, thank you. I wonder if that did anything to Schumacher. I'm sure he had to slow down because of that crash. Let's just stay focused here. Okay, Shumi now more than 5 seconds behind, so he indeed had to slow down because of that crash. Wait, was it DC? I only watched the cap. Yeah, it's DC! Something happened to Schumacher. Yeah, he didn't box, so no damage, apparently. Okay, concentrate, concentrate. Bit pretty soon here, so trying to create a, as big of a uh, as big of a gap as possible, so we don't get mired in traffic.
Okay, a couple of laps and then we'll beat. Wait a minute, do we have enough fuel? Do, do we have to beat up this lap? Okay, let's go in. Okay, boys. Hopefully, I, Eddie has paid you probably properly this time, so you can do this a little bit faster. Come on. Come on. Whoa, that pit exit is ridiculous. Hey man, why are you so slow? I'm a bit worried that DC hasn't fitted yet. If he is on a two, two stopper, then we might have some problems. Then again, if he's on a two-stopper, he will struggle with his tires more. He's 13 seconds ahead. Nice first sector. Bad corner. I'm 
another bad corner. Still a great lap. That's the new tire speaking. Yeah, the pace is good. I, I don't know if we even need to worry about DC being on a two-stopper because we are going to be a lot faster than him. If we don't do any mistakes, that is. Lucky for us, that never happens. Frederick Bang, fastest lap, 8 seconds, no, uh, 9 seconds. Easy with the curbs. Wondering about the strategies is, is, is definitely one of my favorite things in this game. Uh, that's why I like the full length races. Really tried to push it there to get these lapped cars on, on this straightaway, but didn't quite make it. Bad lap because of the traffic. Come on, let me go, dude. What are you doing, dude? Oh, thanks, man. That was great. That was great. Thank you, sir. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. That sucked. And that doesn't really fit our... Sorry about this. Uh, that doesn't really... 
bit, bit, uh, bit our bit strategy, so we'll change it here. Oh man, that sucked. Nice old break test. I'm not giving up. It's going to be difficult now. Hopefully the tires will hold up. is a lot heavier now, I have to remember that. Berker, pitting from P14. Damn, Simtek. And our lap times are not going to be that great anymore because of the fuel load. I think we still have a shot here, but I'll have to drive very, very well. DC now pitting. Come on, let me go, dude. Oh, he did. That was surprising. Also, was surprising that I got the fastest lap there. With the heavy car and all. in the pits, so we'll inherit second place.
DC is not too far ahead, but now he's got the new tires. Never goes the way you plan it. Very good lap. I think we're close enough. You can dive from here, can't you? Sweet slipstream. This is is pulling a cap here because of the rest tires. He seems seems very fast. I wonder if it, if he's short pitting. Come on, let me go, dude. A very dangerous place to pass. This is such a long stint.
Yeah, DC is really flying here now. Can't really go any fast. Oh, we gained a couple of seconds there. Take Hackinen because he just came out of the pits and he's got new tires. Oh man, another seam deck once again. Oh man, another brake test. I hate you guys. But DC had problems with traffic too, so we gained on him because of that. But I have to say, this is a lot, a lot of fun. I'm pushing as hard as I dare. And, you know, who knows how this is going to end. But at the moment I'm having a lot of fun. This is the kind of racing I, I really enjoy when you have to push. Great lap. But DC once again almost mirrored it. Oh, 
Man, this Ligier is annoyingly fast. Mistake there. He's feeling bang breathing on his neck. He'll probably spin or do something stupid and then we'll hit them again. Oops. A little rear lock up there. Have to be careful with those now that the tires are starting to go. They are very bad corner. Schumacher is flying. Bang and easy, very, very evenly matched. Really should break earlier now into the hairpin because it's very easy to lock up the rear tires there and, and spin. Now that the tires are, are pretty much toast. Do you see it being held up <coughs> by traffic? laps to go with these tires and they really don't feel very nice anymore. Oh man, what a traffic jam. Good work there.
Ferrari going nowhere today. Easy with the curbs. Oh man, still 11, 11 laps to go with this. These tires. DC is screwing up with the back marker there. And once again, if there are new people watching, sorry, I can't really uh, focus on the chat too much here. I, I get a glance here and there, but very easy to ruin the entire race if you look at the mo wrong monitor. So yeah, I'm pretty sure DC has got one pit stop to go and so do we. So this is a battle, straight battle for the win. Here. So, should be exciting. Okay. Thanks, man. Oh, man. The what? the hell? Okay. Please no one hit me, please no one hit me, please no one hit me. Another lapped car. Another damn lapped car. I'm speechless. I cannot speak. Like, I was lapping him. And I was already passed. But he just had to hit my rear tire. How lovely.
How unreal. I'm not giving up. Never give up. It's 18 seconds. There's a whole lot of lap uh, race to go still. Five laps and then we'll beat, hopefully for the final time. Lap times are still okay, so the tires aren't completely toast. And we made a lot of time against DZ there. But this train of cars... Oh, this is, this is just what we needed here. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. This time we, 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 we kept our front wing. Oh man, this, <laughs> this is a... This is a nightmare. I don't want to beat yet because like then the final stint is going to be even longer and like I don't want to drive with horrible dry tires. Lost everything we gained on DC there. Oh, you're battling me, aren't you? Go, 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 go. Oh, what a race.
Okay, DC is pitting now. Interesting. We'll still go for one more lap. I'll take my chances with the traffic. This was a good thing. Because there's some traffic in the pits now. And we just had a freaking awesome lap there. Okay, now we have a little tire advantage for the rest of the race against DC. Will it be enough? I do not know. Okay, boys, be quick about it. 29 laps of fuel, it's, that, that, that is going to be enough now, is it? I didn't watch how many laps there are left. Oh, that should be enough. Actually, that's even too much, isn't it? This pit exit is horrible. Right into traffic once again. Why is there always traffic? What are you doing, dude? Okay. A little mistake. My chase is not going too well here. Let's see here, 14 seconds, oh, DC is not actually that far. Mm -hmm. 
Sorry, but this just has to happen right now. Don't have any more time for your shenanigans. Okay, clean track ahead, except that in the horizon there is a, another traffic jam in front. God damn it. Once again, That's how you let, uh, let people go. Oh man, now oh. screw it. <laughs> oh man. Didn't I say at the beginning of the race that the AI seems to struggle with the traffic? This is 19 seconds ahead. Oh, all the incidents with the Back markers, what could have been? No, I'm not giving up. I 
know I can be faster and, and hopefully it's always possible that DC is going to run into trouble with the back markers as well. Got a second that lap, so let's keep on doing that and we'll catch David on the final lap. That was a great lap. More of those, please. 17 seconds. New tires is very fast. Go! That was a fantastic sector. Fifteen seconds to DC. Half the race I've been driving qualifying laps here, so that's pretty crazy.
14 seconds. Oh man, I got a strange lag there and almost grabbed my pants. No more lags, please. Okay. Thirteen seconds. of traffic ahead once again and I got a very bad exit from that corner I wonder if we're close enough here yeah I think we are it's one guy dealt with Okay, Rubens. Twelve seconds. What's happening here now? This is very scary. Okay, that they let me go there. Oh man. in front uh, what happened there holy crap I'm first everybody I'm first hey what's which corner is this DC DC spun DC spun everybody I forgot to drive because DC spun Wrong gear. Focus, focus, okay. Keep your shit together, you idiot. Oh man. Someone is saying that the video is off sync. Is that uh, really happening there? Or do you mean the delay? Because there's a little delay with the chat. It's still working, okay. Now it's heal seconds. 
11 seconds behind and now I, I, I really need to like really need to focus again I once again did that thing when something unexpected happens then I uh, completely lose my concentration Oh man Okay, get a grip, man. Someone should come here and slap my face. Because Damon is going to catch us pretty soon. If we're not careful. Take it easy. Oh man, I love this game. I, I love this game. This is a freaking awesome game. I mean, when do you ever get stuff like that in a Codemasters game? Never, ever, never. You just race against robots and every single race is the same. Trying to tone my driving down a little bit. We don't need qualifying laps anymore. Damon doesn't have the pace in this race, so even if we take it a little bit easy, he shouldn't be able to catch us. We have 96 viewers, now that has to be a new record, welcome everybody, hope you're en enjoying the race. We don't need to rush it anymore, we just can take it easy. Hopefully these guys settle them each other out before this. I, I don't know if you can say that. that. That was weirdly said. Hope these guys will settle each other out. <laughs> Sounds wrong. And probably is. Thank you. 
Yeah, sorry once again, I'm not really paying attention to the chat. Some of you might get bored hearing this all the time, but there are uh, a lot of viewers, so I'm, I'm sure there are quite a bit of new, new viewers. New viewers on the stream. It's getting harder to pronounce because my mouth is very dry. My driving has been okay today, considering I've been doing a lot of like qualifying laps and just pushing it to the max. Uh, but obviously some problems with the back markers. Funny thing is that in my practice races I didn't have any problems with the back markers. that Schumacher? Are we lapping Schumacher or was that Verstappen? He was very fast, so... I don't know. Still safely 13 seconds behind. Okay, it was Jos who we just lapped. Thank you for the info. Okay, this is going to be very annoying. Can I go too? Thank you. track ahead for once at least for a while 
not long ago. Hill, 14 seconds behind. Alezi out of the race. Where is he? Okay, green flag. Hopefully the last Simtek we'll see today. Almost there. Almost there, boys and girls. I know for a fact that there is at least one girl watching. Okay, some traffic ahead, but as I as said, I can take my time with the traffic, so no need to rush it anymore. Whoa! The rear got very, very loose there. I guess the rear tires are starting to go, so let's be careful with the throttle. No problems there. Okay. The final lap, everybody. The final lap of this season of Grand Prix 2. That has taken me about one and a half years to complete. It seems that we're ending it with a win. It will be our... Well, let's not celebrate yet. But if we win, it would be our third win of the season. That's three more than what I expected. I think I've become a better driver during this season. Not quite as many mistakes anymore, but next we're going to hop on to Grand Prix 3, and that's an completely another game. And the physics model is much more detailed there, and the cars don't have this much... Whoa, this guy is very slow. You're having problems, mate. 
he just disappeared. Yeah, that's why he's out of the race. Well, sucks to be him, but here comes Friedrich Bang. And wins the Australian Grand Prix. <coughs> oh man. What a race, guys. What a race. That's where the like, isn't it? I normally don't like to beg likes, but like if you like. It was it was an amazing race, dude. I don't think if we could have got cool hard if, if he hadn't spun, but I want to go here. And some donuts. Everybody, well, half donuts because you can't really make donuts in this game. Could you like be a bit more far away? Race over, everybody, season over. That was nice. That was pretty damn nice. Pretty, pretty damn nice. Yes, race results. Let's see where DC. He he didn't even get a podium after his pin. Uh, he was fourth. Damon Hill, the runner-up. Michael Schumacher, Coulthard. Katayama gets two points for Terrell. So fantastic race for him. First up and Rubens, no points for you. And no points for Ferraris, Berger 8th, and uh, Alesi of course retired, Friends and Pani, Morbidelli, Blundell, Decessoris. Hakkinen had a terrible season. In real life, in 1994, I remember he was 4th in the championship points, but but not, not this time. And here are the rest of the results. So yeah, that was that was pretty cool. Third win of the season for Bang. Best laps, Schumacher, fastest lap, Friedrich Bang, six thousandths of a second slower, but who cares? DC was very, very fast, but unfortunately he couldn't keep it on the track. So that's one of the things you should do. Look who's talking. Let's check out the championship table. Schumacher wins the championship, Damon Hill say, uh, gets the second place, actually that spin DZ had, uh, I think it cost him the second place in the championship, so that's a thing. Friedrich Bang, fantastic fourth in the championship, which basically means that one, two, three, four, we, we like defeat four cars that are, should be like in theory faster than us, so that's great. Rubens, only 10 points. He had a very bad uh, second half of the season. Uh, he was better than us during the first half of the season, but uh, then he kind of melted away. Pani, Brandel, Katayama, Decessor, his friends, and uh, the drivers who got points. Maybe the easy is pun on team orders. <laughs> that's, that's possible. Constructors Championship table, Williams comfortable champion, Benetton, Ferrari, and Jordan fourth in the championship. Now you should change team. I'm going to change team uh, for the Grand Prix three season. Uh, Ligier, Turel, and Sauber are the all, only eight teams got points this season. Here are the season results. Uh, yeah, we'll see what happens in, in Grand Prix 3. Uh, I'm going to probably switch into a better, tree, better team because like Bang it has been very good this season, so why not? I think we deserve a better car and especially for Grand Prix 3 I, I like, couldn't pull off anything with a weaker car because that game is so 
so much more difficult. Uh, if we see the results here, first half of the season, uh, two points from Aida, then four points from Monaco, we were third, and then third and fifth in, in these races. Rubens, at some point, he was getting points in every other race or something. Fifth here, sixth, fifth, fifth, sixth. But then the rest of the season, only one fifth position and, and nothing, no points after that. So that's interesting. Whereas we did, we had a very good, uh, very good ending for the season. Like four consecutive points finishes and, and three wins. So that was that was pretty pretty good. <coughs> car performance is the same for player car unless you patch it. Uh, yes, it is, and I am going to patch it. I'm going to in in Grand Prix two the same way that I did in Grand Prix. Uh, no, what am, I, what, what am I talking about? In Grand Prix 3, I'm going to set the car before... Uh, <laughs> oh man, I should drink something. Car performance team dependent. Uh, so, so that's what's going to happen. Yeah, this is patched and, all, past, patched and all, also uh, Grand Prix 3 will be patched. So the... The performance is uh, team dependent. Uh, Shumi managed to get only one win. Second half of the season. Let's see here. Second, 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 one, fifth. Yeah, a very dreadful ending for the season. So Damon really had a sh shot there to, to get back into the game, but he failed. Uh, also, Damon had like uh, what one, two, three retirements? How many did Schumacher had? Two. So yeah, not not a big difference there though. We didn't get that many retirements. Like one, two, three, three retirements the whole season. That's not too shabby. So it's it's nice. Yeah. Uh, anyway. The reason why we had this game uh, now was that I, I uh, kind of got a little burnout with IndyCar racing after the the Indianapolis 500. That that race took so much energy and effort from me, the, the practicing and everything. So that I needed a break from that. And uh, also, 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 I'm I'm very anxious to get to Grand Prix 3. Hopefully, that works works all right and, and we don't get any crashes or anything because that game it, it, it is a little bit iffy with modern computers but so far it has been uh, has been uh, uh, working pretty well with my, with my Windows 7 computer will you ever come back to GP2 with another year mod yes yes we will yes I will definitely uh, we will after this like we will jump directly to year 1998 so we will have some caps to fill so we will do that with probably with Grand Prix 2 because I'm too uncomfortable modding Grand Prix 3 because it's it's like it's not working the, the game game might become unstable or something and I'm scared of that so I'm not going to run any 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 uh, that uh, IndyCar racing seems more stressful than GPs. Yes, it is. <clears throat> it, it it is. I, I mean, in in IndyCar racing, the the AI is so erratic that anything can happen at any given moment, and it also takes a lot of practice for me just to like find out the ways you can avoid the crashes. Sometimes you just can't. The the AI is is so messed up there. So. But we'll we'll return to IndyCar racing. I I think I'll take a little bit more relaxed approach to it, and and I don't I'm not going to practice that much. And like if we fail, we fail. But I want to complete the season. 
Yeah, it's easy to put mods on GP2 since you can have it installed in DOSBox and Defend Reloaded. And you can also have like separate folders of GP2 with different mods and then you can run it with the same DOSBox. <coughs> yeah, I'm going to do the 1995 CFT. I'm not sure if I'm not going to do do it with GP2 or IndyCar Racing 2. I want to get uh, do IndyCar Racing 2 as well. So we'll we'll see how how that goes then. <coughs> I haven't had a chance to do any NASCARing yet. I, I I was talking about doing a short season with short races and just few races, but I've been very busy and I've kind of forwarded all my energy to like practicing GP2 and also making the GP2 uh, to the uh, GP3 to the point where where I can stream it so yeah I'm going to do Papyrus NASCAR Racing 1 uh, then maybe someday 2 and 3 uh, after four, I don't know because after that the AI got, gets kind of messed up in in the NASCAR series because they they first of all they changed the physics engine and also they started to uh, focus more into online racing and you know good for them now it's uh, like i racing and it's working really well but those I think NASCAR racing from NASCAR racing four is not very good to play by yourself against the AI. It's 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 a bit tricky. IndyCar Racing One is is good uh, because like I get to learn the tracks. Most of the tracks I think are, are also in in IndyCar Racing Two. NASCAR Racing Two Thousand and Three AI is good. Okay, I've never played Two Thousand and Three myself. We might do it uh, at the moment iRacing is developed by the Papyrus guys. Yes, indeed. It's a different company, but it kind of continued the the work of Papyrus. And uh, I think they used some of the source code of NASCAR Racing 2003 in, in the first versions of, of iRacing. GPL, please. <laughs> well, someday, someday I will do GPL for sure. Should be, should be fun. Should be very difficult as uh, 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 as well. Carmageddon has a good AI too. Like, if you want, go and follow me on Twitch. Uh, I might do some like more relaxed racing there someday, and I will do practice races and and practicing for for the real races on YouTube on Twitch. So go check it out. It's uh, the link is in the video description and on the channel page and on the website and everywhere. <clears throat> yeah, I Racecraft has got a lot of good TPL videos and he's much better driver than I am. So go check that out. But anyway, I think it's time to hit the hay. Uh thanks for the season everybody. Uh it's been a very successful season. Like the channel has grown. This this is a hobby for me and it always will be. I'm not going to be a professional YouTuber ever because of the kind of content I make. Uh, this is this is a very niche thing, but but I, I it's amazingly fun to watch your races. Thanks, John. Uh, pleasure is all mine. I've been having a lot of time, and this is a really, really, really great hobby for me. And and like today, my family is away. My my wife and and my daughter went to see some some relatives so it's great to have some social life uh social life here on the old internet while they're away and and it's it's, uh, it's been really really nice and and the chat has been super clean oh, oh, always like there's no annoying people there at all so that's unbelievable so many people but no no one is annoying that's that's fantastic so far, I haven't had to like promote anyone to uh, be as a moderator or anything because the chat is so clean and fantastic. So yeah, thanks everybody for watching. I will save this season so I can 
like watch it afterwards. I oh this is a new new image here, new picture. It's a nice picture. Yeah, look at those old F1 cars. They are so beautiful. Yeah. Anyway, anyway, stay care. Hope you hope you all stay safe and uh, yeah. I will see you. I think the next thing I'm going to do is probably Grand Prix 3 because that's what I want to do. So see you there. Goodbye. Thank you.